your choices, your squad, your shepherd, relive the legend in a remastered edition of the highly acclaimed trilogy. Mass Effect Legendary Edition arrives spring 2021. Hey dudes, how you doing? It's Saint. I'm excited. I'm excited. I didn't plan this. I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna roll with it, okay? I'm just gonna wing it. This is super exciting to me. The Mass Effect Legendary Edition is now a officially confirmed by Bioware in a tweet, in a blog post, and I would assume in YouTube, though I haven't really honestly checked. Let me see. Uh, yup. Yup, it's here. It's here. There's a lot of new information. Well, it's kind of information that I think a lot of us saw coming. Like, I don't think anything they said was particularly surprising, but either way, it's nice to have it confirmed. So the Mass Effect Legendary Edition will include single player base content and DLC for Mass Effect, Mass Effect 2 and Mass Effect 3, plus promo weapons, armors and packs, all remastered and optimized for 4K Ultra HD. It will be available in spring 2021 for Xbox One, PlayStation 4 and PC with forward compatibility and targeted enhancements on Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5. More information to come in the new year. This is all coming from the official Bioware blog post, okay? We also kind of have some news on a new Mass Effect. It's a little bit of news, but it's there. So it's more than what we've had in a long time. It says, Meanwhile, here at Bioware, a veteran team has been hard at work envisioning the next chapter of the Mass Effect universe. We are in early stages on the project and can't say any more just yet, but we're looking forward to sharing our vision for where we'll be going next. There's also a picture that I'm not really understanding very well, considering they like just mentioned like the Mass Effect 5, Mass Effect 4, whatever you want to call it. New project kind of going on. Maybe this is like part of their vision. Maybe they just wanted to like add this kind of idea that they're they're having up until now. I'm not sure, but they added a, a picture that probably has nothing to do with the original trilogy. They also wanted to leave very clear that this is not a remake. This is not a reimagine. This is simply a remaster. For months now, our team at Bioware has been hard at work updating the textures, shaders, models, effects, and the technical features of three enormous games. Our goal was not to remake or reimagine the original games, but to modernize the experience so that fans and new players can experience the original work in its best possible form. It's been amazing to see the adventures of Commander Shepard take on new life in super sharp resolution, faster frame rates, and beautiful visual enhancements. As game developers, we always hope that our games will transcend their original platforms. Having the opportunity to remaster the trilogy means that the fruits of a decade of our work will live on and will be experienced better and clearer than ever before. We are going to get faster frame rates, which would be very well appreciated, obviously. We are also getting, you know, new textures, shaders, stuff like that. We're it's it is what it is you know it's a remaster i don't know if this is a good thing i don't know if this is maybe kind of like a disappointment to an extent considering a lot of us had issues with the ending of mass effect 3. i hope they at least like correct that part you know at least that they at least extend that part where you can you know see your your person your shepherd just being happy with their love, something like that. We'll have to see. What we can confirm is that what we thought before is true. It is coming in early 2021, but not as early as we probably thought. It's coming around March, if it's spring. It's like the 20th of March when spring begins. So they still have a couple of months to see a lot of things. I'm excited, honestly. I'm, I'm glad that what I thought was true. I'm glad that the speculations were true. I'm excited, I wanna play the game, yeah. Yeah, I'm just excited. Honestly, I'm sorry. I, I don't have more words because it it's a game that means a lot to me. And I know it means a lot to other people as well. Tell me in the comments, are you guys excited? Are you guys going to buy the trilogy again? I personally will. This is a great opportunity for people that haven't played it to experience it. Tell me what, what you know, if you're excited too, you know? Tell me if you, you look forward to getting in the trilogy again. Are you going to wait and see if something from the ending changes? What, what are you gonna do? Uh, I'd love to see what you guys are thinking in the comments down below. Leave a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. I upload videos every single week about tech and gaming. And uh, I hope you have a good one. Bye-bye.